as all my masters are. I found the ground was fake so hard, was more like bricks than clay. I could not drive my furrow through, nor would my beasts obey. The more I whipped and cursed and swore, the less my cattle tried. Dobbin lay down, and bold and star, my wits and curse defy. Till all at once appeared a youth, he seemed to hang in air. And all around a dazzling light, which caused mine eyes to stare. Give over, cruel wretch, he cried, do not thy beasts abuse. Think if the ground were not so hard, would they their work refuse? Besides, I heard thee curse and swear, as if dumb beasts could know. Just what thine oaths and curses meant, or better for them go. But you should know that there is one who knows thy sins full well. And what shall be thine after doom, another shall thee tell. No more, he said, but light as air, he vanished from my sight. Sun's bright beams, and all was dark as night. Thunder roared from underground, the earth did seem to gape. Blue flames broke forth, and in those flames a dire gigantic shape. I soon shall call thee mine, it said, in a voice both dire and deep. Quivering like an aspen leaf, I wakened from my sleep.